Welcome to the Fishing Musicians Fishing and Travel Adventures. Welcome to the Fishing Musicians. My name is Glenn Ferguson, your host. Thanks for tuning in. This week, we are on two separate journeys. Beef Wolf and the boys of the Wild Pitch Band scour the Bay of Chaleur and the Bathurst, New Brunswick region for the Atlantic mackerel. The Atlantic mackerel fill the waters of the Bay of Chaleur in the warm summer months, making Bathurst the mackerel capital of the world. We will also take you back to Labrador, part two of the Awesome Lake Lodge adventure with Mick Emmons and our co-host, Mr. Jim Blewett of the Isaac and Blewett Band. Labrador is home to some of the most productive speckled trout fisheries in the world. And the landscape that surrounds Mick Emmons' famous Awesome Lake Lodge takes us back in time with this untouched, rugged wilderness. This is Canada. And this is just sick. Finishing our Labrador adventure, I am whisked away in a private jet by Capital Airways back to Bathurst to meet up with the Wild Pitch Band and another 500 of our closest friends for a rock and roll summer party at the Bathurst Marina. We offer a party that some shouldn't forget, but probably can't remember. Keep your guitars right. in tune. We'll be right back with The Fishing Musicians. The Fishing Musicians is brought to you by Capital Airways. Atlantic Canada's premier air charter service. And Ferguson Audio Productions, one of Atlantic Canada's finest video and audio post-production studios. You're watching The Fishing Musicians. We are at the world famous Awesome Lake Lodge in Labrador with our co-host, Mr. Jim Blewett of the Isaac and Blewett Band. Oh! oh! Man, you should have what seen what just went beside this, man. <laughs> look, look, Watch look. Out. Do you see him? Maybe look at that, he's right behind way. him. If we could. Lift her up. Oh, buddy. <laughs> there was a huge thing just going along beside it. Look at that. You see him, eh, man? You should have seen the fish that was coming along behind this guy, man. Ready to eat it, eh? Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I'm looking for extra teeth here now, man. <laughs> awesome Lake Lodge in Labrador, Canada, folks. One of the best places in the world to come fishing. This is a dream trip for me and for all of these guys that are here. I've been waiting a long time for this one. I've been to a lot of places fishing, but this is one of the special ones. There you go, Brian. I think I have one on now. Yes, sir. A Labrador trout here. Oh yeah, nice one. Not too big. We're using a big orange bomber. Is that what we're using, Terry? Big orange bomber. Came yeah. up and grabbed that. Underneath the boat here. And look at the colors on that, folks. You won't find a prettier fish in the world as well. Oh, oh, <laughs> excellent. Look at that. Oh, nice little, little small thing. little truck. Oh, and there's the orange bomber. Hold it up to the camera, Terry. Take it. Beautiful trout. You mind if I get a hold Oops. on that, Terry? Yes. It's a barbless hook, as you see. Now, folks, it's been hard, real hard fishing here. Got that bomber on there. Just came up real nice. Here, buddy. Be as gentle as we can with these fish. That, folks, is one of the prettiest colored fish. Is this a small male? Small male. Start developing its kite. That little bottom jaw there. How the, uh, the mouth starts turning upwards. Getting ready for its spawning colors. Look at the definition of these colors. Incredible. Labrador, Canada. Let's put it back. Practice from another day. Well, our 
Labrador trip turned out to be more than we had ever hoped for. The weather wasn't uh, so great, but the fishing was. And of course, I never caught the biggest fish. The bragging rights go to Stewart on this trip. And though there's no tangible trophy to offer Stewart, at least I can give him this memory that I'm sure he'll live a lifetime and will never slip away. Now, before you leave, check your room, tidy up, tip your guides, check your bags, and use the washroom. Hey, Jim! Get over here, the plane's ready! Just a sec, I gotta use the Arts and Cultural Center, man. Be careful of those Hershey squirts. You need some bum one. Get back here. Emergency! Hold the plane. Hold the plane. All right. Uh, you gotta use this when you hit the art gallery, man. Need some toilet paper? I need some toilet paper. Uh, oh, come on, man, <laughs> come on. <laughs> oh, thanks, man. You know, owning your own private jet, flying to these fishing trips makes things a whole lot easier. 50 minutes from Goose Bay directly to Bathurst. You know, chartering an airplane is not as hard as you may think, and it's not as expensive as you may think. Bob Hathaway of Capital Airways in Fredericton, New Brunswick explains. Within char the charter business, the economies of scale make a big difference. So if, if you have two or three people or four people that are going somewhere, oftentimes the hard costs of that charter are equal to whatever the costs are going to be on a commercial flight. Um, Beyond that, you factor in things like time. So let's take what's two days. Let's take it's one day on either in either end that you have to spend traveling. That's extra. Well, what's somebody's time worth? Well, you take Jimmy or somebody that does uh, a lot of uh, shows all over the place, and his time is very valuable. And if he has an opportunity to go to another another show because he's home and he's fresh and he's ready to rock and roll, then. You know, that's a big difference for him just from being able to book, it, book his time and where he's exactly. supposed to be. Enough is enough, you guys. Bring the bum wad. Welcome to the Fishing Musicians Fishing and Travel Adventures. Woke well, up this morning at the crack of town. I put my red and my downtown. I grab my rod and I sing a song. How my boys will be right through the pond. The sounds come away over the trees. Singing to the birds, making love to the bees. Work on my fish head. Fish head. Why am I fish head? Turn on a fish head. The sounds come away over the trees. Singing to the birds, making love to the bees. Go down. Welcome folks to the Fishing Musicians. My name is Glenn Ferguson. We are in Bathurst, New Brunswick. It is August and mackerel fishing is on once again. Guess who I got this week? The Wild Pitch Band. Folks, Beef Loaf. Once again, Beef Loaf. We got Beef Loaf here. Ron Jones on drums, folks. Luke Doucette here, bass player. You'll see us play after. And of course, the Rocket MLA, uh, Brian Kenny. So guys, we got Daryl Knowles down here. He's got the boat ready. We're at the Bathurst Marina. Let's go rock and roll and catch Let's some rock. Let's go! Let's rock. Sounds come away over the trees. Singing to the birds, making love to the bees. I got my fish head. I got my fish head. I got my pole. Taxi! Taxi! something special for you. I've used this before in episodes and I, I want to hand it to you to let you use for this evening. It's my daughter's uh, Dora Rod. And Dora the Explorer? Dora the Explorer. My favorite. 
Oh, here you go, man. You'll be able to use this. I said I'm fishing, and I got my pole right here. Fishing. Get on a fishing. The sun's come away all on the trees. Singing to the birds, making love to the bees. Okay, folks, so if you're wondering here, we're fishing mackerel, Atlantic mackerel. We're on the uh, northeast coast of New Brunswick, our hometown, Bathurst, New Brunswick. And mackerel start running here like crazy in August. And uh, you got to find the right spot. And once we do, everyone's going to start catching them. So the, the game is on here to see who catches the first one, hey, guys? Okay. How's everyone over there? Everyone geared up? And... Maybe I'll have be beginner's luck. Okay. Okay, guys, get oh. your rods in the water. There we go. There get we go. that Barbie rod in the water, Kurt. <laughs> Oh, no, baby. That's so there you go, Curtis. Start yeah, we got a bucket there for the. That's a baby one, but there you go. Congratulations, Brian. You've, uh, you've won the contest for the first mackerel. Well, thank you for the invitation. Blake. You win the uh, the opportunity to clean every one that we catch. Excellent. I <laughs> only it's my medication. Go get daddy a beer and a popsicle. Go get daddy a beer. Brian's got another one here. Ah. Ah, that's it. Ah. I got one. I got one. Curtis got one on the Burby. On the Burby. Oh, hey. I got one. Right oh. 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 hey. I got right one. lost it. You got to oh. see him fish. Yeah. Just like that, baby. Come on, baby, let's go party. Get your fish in the water. Well, if you ride, don't jig, you ain't got a chance. Make that hole and make your fin dance. Can't get your fish if your line ain't in the water. Go, Kurt, go. I say, can't fish if your line ain't in the water. Can't get your fish if your line ain't in the water. Well, if you ride, don't jig. Chance, make that hole and make you fin dance. Can't catch a fish if your line ain't in the water. It's true. If you don't put your line in the water, can't get a fish. Forget the fancy stuff, hey Kurt. You just yeah. gotta get that line in the water. That's it. Bathurst is located on the east coast of Canada. It is filled with year-round tourism activities. We have warm summers and white gold, the world's best snowmobiling trails. Bathurst is found in the province of New Brunswick, which borders the provinces of Quebec to the north, Nova Scotia to the southeast, and the United States to the west. Bathurst is also next to the Bay of Chaleur, which is part of the Atlantic Ocean. Ron, holy jeez, what do you got there, man? Look at that. Oh yeah, you got one. Oh yeah. No, I think your action is, uh, you're, you're really playing that. Oh, look at Rugged Ronnie! Hold it! Oh! Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Glenn Ferguson. Keepers. Keepers. Everybody does a keeper. <laughs> Folks, we are totally sober. Water, like I said, you gotta stay hydrated out here. Oh! Crazy over here. Crazy fishing. You got it, Luke? Brian <laughs> going a mile away. He's not only the rocket MLA, he's a master, master fisherman. He's the pocket fisherman. Yep. <laughs> he never, ever, ever gets gunk here in Bathurst macro fishing. All along the coast, everywhere along here. You come here in August, millions of jellyfish, millions of mackerel. Oh, Luke's got one. I got one. Oh, yeah. There, there you go. go. Finally. Woohoo! Is this your fish, first fish, Luke? Yep. Is this your oh, first boy. time in a boat, too? Yep. First time, yep. First time for everything, folks. Uh, you, have you ever, you ever touched a live fish, then? No. Yeah. Okay, well, let's get this on camera here. Luke, do see the bass player wild pitch. You'll see him play after. Oh. Kick butt. Okay. <laughs> okay, you gotta go throw that in the... Uh, oh, he's crapping on you. You know the Atlantic uh, macro have several anuses? Oh, he, they're just crapping all over you. See? <laughs> There you go, there's your supper. Oh, he's <laughs> grout! Oh, I got one! It's almost time to head back in, guys. Maybe we'll sing a song for the folks at home because I know you were called the fishing musicians and we don't always have a lot of music on a lot of the shows, but we're gonna play music. It's with these guys here. We have a lot of fun. We can play all night. Let's, uh, 
Let's pick up a song owed to Daryl's boat here. What's, what's your boat called, Daryl? Salty Dog. Oh, Salty Dog. Salty Dog. I got the salty rope. Try and find my... Come on, baby, well, it ain't no joke. Come on, the Salty Dog. Come on, that Salty Dog. Come on, baby, well, it ain't no joke. I got my salty dog. Here's my salty dog. Did that work already? Yeah. Right, I'm changing it. No, no, no cameras anymore. No cameras. Over here, look. There you go. Oh, he's coming over this way. Oh, nice one. Oh, you got a nice one. Oh, oh, look at that one. Oh, don't lose that. Woo-hoo-hoo. Oh, yeah. Can you get that one oh, for me? That last one was kind of slimy. Oh, slimy. Oh. <laughs> oh, look, don't pull on that. Give your, you gotta kiss your mackerel, okay? We're on fish. Everyone kisses their first fish. Come on! Here, give me a little kiss. Give him a little kiss. No, no, no. Give me a little kiss. Come on, just one, please. Kiss it! Kiss it! Oh! Hold to the mackerel. Very hard. You know, this sounds similar to a Canadian curling game gone all wrong. Oh, oh, there you go. Oh, 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 that's a nice one. Big one. Oh, that's a nice one. Now that's a big fish. Oh, oh right. give me that big up girl right now. I'm, oh, I've been that. on by mackerel. <laughs> <laughs> I can't work like this. I can't work like this. Sorry, it's not in the budget, man. She's breaking the rod for the love of God. Oh, my God. They brought her right up. Right here. I'm going to pick up. Okay, he's only holding it. I got one. Oh. All right. Woo! It's my first one. Go on, go on, go on! <laughs> <laughs> Trying to rob him. Rusty. <laughs> Rusty. 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 Oh, look at the size of this one. Oh, that one's oh, good. Yeah. Oh, that's a good one. There's a nice one. Look at that, Brian. There's the prize one of the day, buddy. There's a the prize, oh, oh, boys. Oh, oh, look at that size of that. I got one. Look at that. Look at that. I got one. Then got one on there. There's Folks, we're having wicked macro fishing here in Bathurst, New Brunswick. You gotta come here and visit our website, fishingmusicians.com. Show the big one. Throw come here, buddy. Oh, well. Yeah, throw that one back. Put it on my hook. Conservation. Don't throw them back, put them on my hook. If you wanted some of the best macro fishing in the world, folks, like I've always said, when you come here fishing, it's Bathurst, New Brunswick. We'll be right back with the Fishing Musicians. Ron's got one on, too. Lock the doors and put the kids to bed. You're watching The Fishing Musicians. There's a rainbow, boys. Oh, there's a nice one, too. Oh, there's a nice one, too. B-A-T-H-U-R-S-T. Bathurst, the place to be. There's no shore like the North Shore. Hey, that's for sure. B-A-T-H-U-R-S-T. Well, folks, you know we really aren't that crazy. Maybe just acting a bit for the television show. But we sure did have a whole lot of fun. And we've also organized a private party for some of our closest friends to rock at the Bathurst Marina until the wee hours of the morning. We fit in three hours of sleep, one hour of jogging, and then we were at the rehearsal hall. This one here is called Caroline. Went down to Georgia, down to New Orleans, back to Memphis, back to Tennessee. I see the girl with a snake on her back. I tell you, boy, she gives heart attack. That's right, sweet, sweet Caroline. She my sweet, sweet Caroline. Baby 
Next week on The Fishing Musicians, we take you down under Australia. Got him. We are fishing with the guy they call in those parts, Ditch, short for didgeridoo. I wonder why. We are sandboarding. We're seeing lots of the native wildlife, as Jennifer, my wife, and me, of course, celebrate our anniversary. I do some jamming, we visit Sydney, back to the spot we were married, and of course, I act a little crazy, don't I? This is all next week on The Fishing Musicians. Round a boat, bring it me. Round a boat. Round a boat. Anchors away! On the anchor down! Hey, right side! Time to go fishing. What's wrong with you? You're not going to church for the love of God, you're fishing. Hey, is there any Dicky D out here? Or what? Somewhere over the rainbow. Hippie, <laughs> hippie. Don't get the clam yet. <laughs> Fox, well, absolutely, there was no fish harmed in this episode. Robot fish. <laughs>